Hi, my name is Uli Morse and I'm the inventor of the Rotor Z adapter. What is the Rotor Z adapter? Well, the Rotor Z adapter is a mount adapter between PL and E mount or between EF mount and E mount. And what it simply does is it takes a 9 by 16 picture coming into the lens uh, and turns it to 16 by 9 so that any camera in the market uh, can record the 16 by 9 picture just natively. Well, actually, just to explain how it works, the light goes through the lens, it hits the first mirror in the adapter, so actually it goes through the first mirror, hits the second one, the second one bounces its back with its millions of mirrors, micro-mirrors, um, and the micro-mirrors replace the picture and they simply shift it pixel by pixel. And then it hits the first mirror and it bounces back through the second mirror and uh, so the picture gets um, rotated by 90 degrees. And this is just a small test, uh, test setup that I've built. So uh, we have the adapter already. This is uh, still in beta, a beta version. So it's a review version, only working in HD. And um, the next versions will be 4K, probably coming end of the year. And there will be two versions. There will be a version um, EF to E mount, and there will be a version like this, PL, to E mount, uh, this will be a higher sophisticated adapter than the smaller one. So they will be different priced. And the PL version will also have phase inversion lighting. So this is a method that uh, CrossShield developed uh, to reduce the light loss within the adapter. So actually the PL version will have one stop of light loss while the smaller budgeted version will have two stops of light loss because there will be the missing phase inversion lighting. There's already one university uh, reviewing the adapter. It's the University of Münster. They already have the adapter and Professor Henning Tietz will explain how they do it. 9 to 16 is important because it's part of the students' everyday life. It's their reality. The content they consume is in 9 by 16 and um, it's their reality, it's, it's what their media gives them and it's what they expect from professional media productions. This Rotor Z adapter is important for the future of universities because it bridges the gaps between the students' everyday realities from now and their futures as content creators. It enables them to produce 9x16 material in cinema grade quality without any steps in between. It's just simply the future. The future will be 9x16 and this enables students to work in that future. I found uh, some partners for it. So one most important partner is the firma CrossSeal in Germany and uh, this is what they say about the adapter. Rotating an image based on technology and electronics is a perfect idea. So when we heard the first thoughts about it, our team right away jumped onto it and um, right away started developing it. We have um, young filmmakers who have to look at the budget, so we did create a version which is good enough for EF mount lenses um, to really give nice quality uh, and give the functionality of upright or rotated images. On the other hand, we needed for the real professional high-end world something which they are used to work with us. So we have this PL mount version which has full electronic communication. It has um, shimmable mount so even you can shim it perfectly to your lens so that you have the right focal markings on your lens and this is so crucial for focus pulling and focus assisting. On the higher priced model we have a new technology based on face inversion lighting which means that the array uh, hitting the first mirror inverts the face and goes back and then through the mirror to, to project it on a um, 9 by 16 format. And the neat thing about it is that you have a higher quality of light and on the other hand, you lose less light. So instead of having a two-stop of light loss, which you would have in the lower end model, here you only have one stop of light loss and with modern technology, modern lenses and high-speed um, lenses, you have nearly no, no down point on that. 
Okay, if you want to see uh, the adapter live, uh, CrossGill will go to NAB in April, mid-April, and will show the adapter live to the audience, um, and you're welcome to stop by. So the Rotorset adapter will be introduced and seen live at NAB in Las Vegas, mid of April. And we are even thinking about offering the first 100 units for free to visitors at our stand. So make sure you stop by and um, let's chat about it and look at it in real life.